house. What is going on? Lord and it's Fano. It's 5 a.m. and welcome to my morning routine. It's way too early for this business. There are a whole variety of morning routines on my channel and they've evolved over time from when I went to high school, when I went to uni, working from home. I now have a new job. I do not work from home anymore. I still work at 7 a.m in an office and you're like, Emma, what do you do for two hours before you have to go to work? Glad you asked because that's what I'm about to show you. Hey Siri, turn on TV lights. Oh, stunning. Then we're going to turn on the TV. We have the fireplace. I am making an effort to get very comfortable right now because the first, honestly like the first hour of my day is just purely dedicated to my devotional time. So before I go to bed the night before, over here. Laptop, my Bible, my Devo, my highlighter, and my pen. Let's grab that, get cozy, and uh, spend some time with Jesus. I do try, because I'm up at stupid o'clock in the morning, I do try and do as much of my morning routine the night before so that when I wake up in the morning, things are already in place that just like keep the ball rolling. For example, setting this up over there just so I don't have to think about where it is or what I'm doing. You may be able to see in the corner of the screen, I do have my outfit set up over there. When I started my new job, I had a little bit of a dilemma because in my opinion, you shouldn't be waking up before five o'clock unless you've got somewhere really awesome to be. Like catching a flight. I was like, I'm not gonna wake up any earlier than five o'clock because before five o'clock, that's just kind of stupid. I have two hours between waking up and having to be sitting at my desk. Normally, like at my previous job, I didn't start work till 8.30 and I work from home. So I didn't have to account for like traveling to work. So I had a lot of time in the morning. So I would like to have my time with Jesus, I would do my workout, I would take my sweet time cooking up a nice breakfast. Whereas now all of that's kind of been like condensed down. I knew going into my new job that I wouldn't have time to do my workout and also spend time with Jesus in the morning to the extent that I would like to. And so there had to be a little bit of a compromise, a little bit of a decision making. And I had to choose between the workout and Jesus, which... Saying that out loud, it's pretty obvious. Clearly, I've chosen to spend my time in the mornings with Jesus, which is so special. My favorite time of the day. Yeah, it just kind of starts my day off being like, okay, Jesus, this day is yours. You have blessed me with it. I just know that it sets me up to be the best person possible going into my day, which um, is great for everyone. It's great for all parties, trust me. <laughs> I have a full video up on my channel, which is video like, previous to this one, which goes into depth on how I study the Bible and what I actually do in the morning. If you want to go watch that, I will link it. You can go check that out. Flight time is done, so it's time to get out of bed and get myself ready. Start with making the bed. I don't think I can remember a single day since I was like 10 years old that I haven't made my bed. So, let's do it. As I was saying, I set out my clothes the night before, so in the morning, it's just one less thing that I need to think about. This mirror is very high and my tripod is just like a fraction too short. But anyway, I've had a shower. I need to put some stuff on my skin. Oh my gosh, my skin is getting Sahara Desert right now. I need to deal with my hair. Normally I wash it and I straighten it. It is hair washing day today. Sometimes I might just tidy it up with the straightener if it's looking a little bit manky. Oh, it's not too bad today, but these little curly bits at the front are just a little bit chaotic. Oh no, I can just smooth them down because they're oily. And I need to brush my teeth. Whoa. Whoa, oh my gosh, I keep knocking the tripod. <laughs> this is where I put on my jewelry and brush my eyebrows. I swear some days this bracelet just seems shorter than others. And if you care to know, this is the perfume I'm currently wearing. It is the Daisy Wild by Marc Jacobs. Let's put on some shoes. I know, shoes inside can be a bit of an ick. It's something I'm working on, okay? Alrighty. Oh, that probably shows how dirty they are on the bottom. Let's show you the whole outfit. I might need to actually turn the light on. Oh, that's so bright. Here's the outfit of the day. This jumper is from Princess Polly. Literally got it like four years ago. These jeans I got on clearance from A Brand. <laughs> this bag is my uni bag that I bought back in 2019 from Status Anxiety. They don't have this exact style anymore. And then my New Balance 550s on my feet. And... Let's go and pack our lunch and go to work. Guys, look, the sun is just starting to come up. It actually looks stunning. It is time to pack my lunch and my breakfast. I used to eat breakfast in the morning when I before I left home, but then I 
would eat breakfast like 6 30 and then i'd be hungry again by like nine and then it would just like it just got a bit confusing and most people in the office they stop and eat breakfast at like 8 39 ish so now i just do the same um i also meal prepped my lunch on breakfast and lunch this week breakfast is like this muesli yogurt pot i would share the recipe with you but it's actually not that nice i have a couple options for lunch i want to take curry for lunch yum got my lunch got my breakfast oh macho I'll take some munchos. A couple of bags here. One is for crackers and one is for cookies. Crackers I meal prepped as well. They are delicious. This recipe I will put down below because it is my fave. One nice big cookie. I won't share this cookie recipe. I tried a new one and I don't like it. So we won't be sharing that. Mandarin and a kiwi fruit. Take my cup with me. Fill up my water bottle. And that is my work morning routine. I am going to be late, so I need to make some moves, but thank you guys so much for watching. If you made this far in the video, comment something that you do for yourself in the morning. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe, stay well, Jesus loves you, and I will see you in my next video. <laughs>